All right, welcome back, all my little baby bunnies, to Let's Play The Walking Dead, Episode 5. Um, okay. Probably just need to go a little slower. And I know we can't afford dead weight, so... No time left. Don't treat me like I am. We won't. Good. Now what? We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal? Now, let's get our bearings. Into the fire, indeed. So let's walk around a little bit. Hospital must have run out of doctors. Huh. He or she walked away from whatever accident happened. Well, that doesn't really mean much. an extension ladder. Ah, that could be good. Okay. Some poor bastard took a spill. Yeah, looks like whoever was up here painting that sign went ass over tea kettle. What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Huh. Yeah. That could help. Maybe. No way. It's higher than this room, for starters. Okay. I did think it was kind of odd that you gave me the option. Therefore, we need to get the ladder. There we go. I don't know if I'll be able to carry it myself. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, sure can. Whoa, you need some help with that? I got it. Damn it. Uh, uh. Buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down and off the roof the on the opposite side, side and yeah. bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You sense. think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? <laughs> so we're agreed then. Why the hell are we letting the one-armed guy do all the high-risk maneuvers? Because the one-armed guy insists. Now shut up about it. That thing looks a little rickety. Maybe keep that shit to yourself next time. <laughs> yep. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit! Try to find another way out of there? Okay, so there's a trap door. Alright, let's do this. Come 
coming this way! Tons of them! Jesus! Now get back here! It's a hell of a jump, man. I really don't know if I could make that. I think I have to jump! There's no way back! You can make it! It ain't that far! You got this! You right. got this, motherfucker! You a running start, buddy. Good goddamn leap, pal. Oh, that must Let's get the hell off this roof. Painful. Whew. That guy looks super gross. <laughs> It's very business-like. Come on, please! Oh. What are you doing?! Don't get mad. The boat's gone. No shit, it's gone! Relax! Ben, what happened? They were waiting for me in here. Who? Vernon, his whole crew! Was Clementine <gasps> with them? No. He seemed pissed you guys lost her, and, well, they took it. They're gone. Ben, you are worthless! Those motherfuckers. That wasn't Ben's fault, though. What happened to your arm? We cut it off! Ben, I could just kill you right now! I can't believe you didn't even put up a fight! Dude. Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Oh. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. Yeah, chill out, Kenny. We can do this in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? Get to the countryside. Dicked around with cities and coastlines and boats too long. Take her out there. Live as safe as you can, okay? Look, I agree with you. I think out in the country is the safest place to be. But you're not dead yet, so put a pin in that, okay? <laughs> Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill, not just you. Chill? Bandits? Hey, chill! Here's some pills! Vernon, chill! Here's our fucking boat! This isn't my fault. I can't point to one thing that's happened that isn't somehow your fault! Lee should have left you in Crawford. Fuck you, Kenny! Careful, guys! No, let him. I am so, so, so sorry about Katya and Duck. I am! And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around, and stop wishing I was dead! No! You know how they died. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive, or dead, or walkers, or worse, and I don't know! So give me a fucking break! Oh, Ben. I'm... Oh, shit! Here they come! In the house! 
Thank you, Ben, for standing up. They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Thank you so much. Maybe not. <laughs> we can secure this place. Krista. Get on the windows in the front room. Check the boards. Got it. Kenny. Look for weapons. Gather anything you can find. Will do. Ben. Move anything you can up against the doors and windows. Got it. Omi! What is it? Front doors! Oh! Oh, shit. <laughs> Lee! Help! Cut their fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Uh... Hurry! I don't remember there being a knife in here. Got it. Take their goddamn arms off! Done. Now what? Get ready to fight. This place seems dirty to me. I think we're fine. Sturdy my ass! Get upstairs! Go! Guys, help me with this! Get to the end of the hallway. What do we do now? This will slow down. Get to the end of the hallway. Take a fucking stand. Can't let ourselves get trapped. Let's get as many as we can. And when we see an opening, we go for it. How many bullets y'all have? Three. Five. Four. Two. Y'all know where to aim. Get ready. That could have gone better. Everyone okay? Yeah. Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay. Let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent the Third, Industrial... Mead? Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. I'm sorry. So, no ideas then. There's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access, a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. Hey, you're not looking great, and you're warm. I'm okay. Don't... I'm okay. I'm Lily Parrott. No! What did that mean? She's at the hotel, where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. 
We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our... urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. We have to go now. Like right this goddamn minute. Where, Lee? Come on. We're trapped. Do you think that worked? I don't know. I hope so. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. I think it'd be best if we just worried about getting to Clem right now. We're not gonna do her any good if you've attacked us. That isn't gonna happen. How do you know that? Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you! My arm is not the issue! I'm not the problem! The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem! Yeah, maybe at the moment, but who's to say when it becomes an issue? Jesus. At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it! This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me! We will get Clementine back, with or without you, because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. Then kill me, you son of a bitch, okay? Don't even fucking hesitate! I will! Oh. Yeah! You ruined nice. that dude's face. There's your way out. Shut up, <laughs> sweetie. Look. Thanks, I mean, but there's your way out. It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. I'll be damned. Let's get We're not like... <laughs> this wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Did he just say this wall ain't shit? <laughs> I like it. Yeah, we can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. Sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. I'm glad you told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well... We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. Which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. I'd say I am. I am. And when it happened? I panicked. But now I feel it inside me. Like the day before you get the flu. It's horrible. It's so weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be there. I'm hoping whatever's in their bite is gone too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I have no idea. I know everyone's wondering. I mean, it Even was Even if it just slows ago. down the process, I'd be happy. You don't mean that. So when we get this guy, what do you think? Hmm. We'll find out about that next time. Sorry, this will... episode ran a little long, but it was super duper wild. And so much stuff was happening. I was enthralled. Um, damn. All right, well, thanks for watching. As always, it's much appreciated. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.